Greetings, Cosmos, and welcome back to Kirby Superstar. Last time, I thought I completed, uh, Area 3, but then I discovered that I missed some treasures there. So, today, I'm going to be returning to Area 3. Ow. Anyway, returning to Area 3. In order to acquire the remaining treasures. Alright. Ow. Alright, so... Love that triangle jump. There's literally no gameplay when you're riding the trolley, you just sit and watch, and yet I enjoy it so much. I don't know how they managed to do that. When other games take away gameplay for something like that, I get frustrated with it. Alright. So, first off, I'm going to save here, and then, whoops, sheesh, why, I was just trying to do that grab attack. Anyway, you might notice I'm not summoning a helper. There is a reason for that. Oh yeah, I forgot that you could grab attack those cutters. Huh. Okay, this isn't where I intended to go. Guess I gotta head back. Ow. Okay, does this lead where I wanna go? Nope. Boing. Nope. Okay, that wasn't what I intended to do. Or rather, that wasn't what I intended to have happen. I absolutely intended to do a diving kick onto the cannon. Nope, not this one. What I'm looking for is a hammer. My mental map of this place is pretty poor. Ow. Okay, so go through here. Yeah, see, I need a hammer for this, but... Where do I get one? A hammer or a stone. Okay, there's a stone here. Hey, where'd you go? Little rock friend. I want to inhale you and become a little rock myself. Okay, and now I return to that one place. Ah! Okay. Okay. Took took a bit to realize I could only enter through one side there. 
Hey, you come here. All right. The uh, time period for sharing snacks is really generous. I like that. For some reason, I remember there being a hammer guy really nearby. Oh, hey, these elevators. I don't think we've encountered these yet. I like the way these elevators are programmed so they can't kill you. Like, I've had them squished down onto me, and I just pass through to get into them. Whee! Alright, so... Okay, this looks like a return trip. I'm pretty sure I remember, whoa, what's going on in this place, and so that's why I have Burn and Leo as my karma. Oh, hey, look at this. Ow. Sheesh. I am losing abilities. Oh, hey, a turtle shell. I'm losing abilities left and right today. Oh, whatever. As long as my minion still can set things on fire. Yes, see, only a minion, only a helper can do that. Kirby, if he's using the fire ability underwater, just uh, spits water. I got a sword. A very specific sword, I think. But it's a sword that means nothing to Kirby. Oh, right. This is a suplex ability. All right, so let's go into here. Okay. Warrior shield. Not a shield that I recognize. Okay. And that's everything. So, let's head on up. These elevators move so fast, and yet they go so far, it seems like they're going slow. Alright. Now let's get out of here. Alright, next up, save my progress, and then get out of here. Come on, Vernon Leo, get in here. No? Fine. Why are you running backwards from me? I don't understand why you're doing that thing. I remember back when I had this game on my Super Nintendo. Yep, that's the end of that story. At one point I had a controller that, uh... Ow. That I inserted for player two that would randomly activate and, uh... Well, change the computer-controlled helper into player two without anyone there. What was weird about this... Well, what was weirdest about this to me was when it did this... During the attract mode, you know, the bit where they're showing you bits of gameplay and such.
I have no idea what caused it to do that because whenever I tried to do that deliberately, it didn't work. But yeah, randomly during the attract mode demos. There, take that. But randomly during the attract mode demos, it would, uh, oh, uh, it would just activate player two. This is one of those places where you gotta break things down carefully. I got an Xmas tree. Took me way too long to figure out that you could just, you know, fly with Kirby to disable the wall jumping. Okay, I didn't get it. Okay, get in here and see if this leads anywhere. What? Oh. I'm just being dumb. I need to... Okay, there we go. I just need to connect the entire fuse. And now, I can go into one of my favorite screens in this whole game. I don't know why I like this place so much, but I do. And this whole game, I mean the Great Cave Offensive. Specifically, not a Kirby Superstar in general. Ramia's Scale. Is Ramia a reference to Dragon Quest? I don't know why I did that. I did not think that all the way through. Okay, so before moving on, I, I love how they indicate places that you can travel through with the uh, stars here. The first time I played this, I spent so much time trying to just press against random things, not even paying attention. Okay. Kong's Barrel. Take that, Donkey Kong. I have stolen your barrel. Okay, is there anything up here that I want? Let's see here. I guess I want to go this way first. Okay. I, I don't have memorized all the locations of all the treasures, obviously. Whoops. So, places like this make me paranoid that I'm going to miss some treasure if I don't smash everything. Even though I'm pretty sure there's nothing here. Yep, nothing here. Whee! Flying Kirby. Alright, gonna descend through here. Get into this door. Uh, oh. This one requires a helper. Why would you line up the star block with the door? Okay, well since helper isn't helping, there is an alternative method. Yeah, let go of me, helper. There we go. Shiny bamboo, as opposed to just normal bamboo. Alright, let's see here. 
anything interesting up here? Of course there is. Oh, hey. Oh. I think I want a helper. Yes. Oh. Okay. Oh, so close. Yes, yeah, so far. Okay, so what I want to do is wait here. And really? I was still considered to be on the slope there. Well, time to go back. I like how you can ride the wheelie helper. It's really cool and fun. Even if it's a, not very good for much besides solving a couple of puzzles which are implemented specifically for the wheelie helper. There we go. And I got a tire. And now we go back. All right, so I could go through here. The infinity jump. So there's a star to get you back if you uh, want to go back. Okay, so I think I need a rock ability for this. And it looks like there's nothing special here. Well, maybe not a rock ability, but an ability that can attack below me. It can attack that one boss from Super Mario RPG. Ah. Okay, here's how I get over here. Yeah, that would make my helper le be less annoying. That's the problem with the wheelie helper. It's cool for some things. Spirit charm obtained. But then annoying for others. Okay. These star blocks are weirdly colored. Alright, now let's try this chamber again. Anything over here? No? That star there is just to distract you from the path. There we are. And I like how Kirby eats all these sweet things to heal himself, and then his favorite food's a tomato. Alright, so I think we're about one third of the way done with, uh... Area 4. Join me next time when we take on more of Area 4. I'll see you then.